four tone. Very solid signal, but I've got this big tree root right here, man. This is gonna be a huge pain in the butt. I had to change my battery just in case this took 10 minutes to extract out, and I think it will. It's underneath the root there. It's directly underneath the root there. This thing has sounded awesome. It, sound, it was in the 90s in three tone, and it sounded deep, man. So what I'll do is I'll just open up, because I know it's directly underneath there. I need to open up a large hole here, right? Open up a large hole, kind of make a mess just a little bit, but I know it's gonna be underneath there. A little bit bigger hole here, because I don't want to scratch it up, right? Make a large hole here on one side of the root, because I know it's right underneath there and I'll just start extracting it really slow here on the other side just start getting it down a little bit deeper here I want to go as deep as I can so I can get a bunch of soil that pop loose down there as you try to attack it like that right there you're gonna bust it you're gonna scratch it up really bad it could be a it could be a, a silver coin but it's could be a nail too right so i'll just dig straight down here i don't want to i don't want to uh i don't want to dig in underneath the root right where that coin is at or wherever that target's at right i'll just go straight down here because i know it's directly under the root like i say the good stuff is underneath the roots man just need to extract it out there sometimes these tougher targets take a while to get man Need to open up a little bit more on this side because I want it to come out clean, right? I want it to come out in a clean plug there. Just waller it out, get it out nice and open there so I can bust it loose. Because with coins like this, it could be a half dollar, it was reading up really high. So, so I just keep on scraping. I want to know how. I wonder how close I am to this target, right? So I'll just start working at it just a little teeny bit because I know I'm not close to it yet, right? It's directly right underneath the root. I think it's right in here. So I'll just work it out. Just try to work it out just a little bit at a time. Hope I can get it to bust loose there. I don't want to scratch it. Is it a nail? I think it's a nail. pinpoint it again with my detector. It sounds so good. Now I'll take my shovel and get it and just pop it out. Pop it out. Get some leverage on it. I hope they'll come popping out there. It just, the ground is so dry here. It's not gonna work like that. Directly underneath it, oh man. Hope I didn't just scrape it. Is it a nail? I don't think it's a nail. I think it might be a spike right there. Yeah, it is a spike. Pop it out right here. It's a spike. There we go. Yeah, it's a nail. I'll just, I'll be rough with it. It just sounded so good, right? There we go. Got it. Right there. 
was a rock. I know what I got in my Christmas stocking this year. Got a freaking chunk of coal, man. That thing sounded awesome, man. That's exactly what it was. Chunk of charcoal, man. It happens, dude. It happens, man. See? It's gone. This is what charcoal sounds like. When it's out of the ground. When it's in the ground, it sounds awesome. Just like ash. If you try to um, let go and detect over a bunch of ash, you're not going to find anything, man. It's just going to overload. No detector will get through ash. Which is crazy phenomenon, right? Charcoal is just a weird th phenomenon. Well, I got some charcoal in my stocking for this Christmas, right? I got an early Christmas present. <laughs> I was hoping that was silver, man. You know? You can always hope for the best. Just clean up the mess there. Got some charcoal out, All right? Well, thank you for watching. Please subscribe.